we live in a world now where you are rarely going to be in a position um, for 30 years or 20 years. Mm. You know, the way a previous generation, if somebody might have worked at GE or Ford for a whole lifetime, you know, now you're really going to have different phases of your career. And the one thing uh, that really stands out, even in this partnership, uh, is that bringing the public and private and media together um, is, is always going to be critical. So having a chance to work in government for a period of time, to work in the private sector, to work in the public sector, gives you, I think, kind of a really well-rounded experience base for any role that you're going to have. Um, I spent 15 years in government and really was such an honor and a privilege. And now that I'm at Goldman Sachs, I have the chance to see kind of the flip side of how you execute with uh, a little more efficiency. Sorry, Karen. <laughs> um, you know, because... Well, she agrees, don't worry. <laughs> right. the, the, you, you've heard my bosses talk about, you know, measurement, results, budget. Uh, you know, there's no shutdown at Goldman Sachs. <laughs> we, we have to, you know, really um, do the st same strategic planning as the busy units do. And I think that's what's differentiated 10,000 women and, and it's made us proud is that we have actually tracked every single woman around the world that we work with and every small business owner and really tried to prove the case, make the data set very clear that when women are economically empowered, not only does GDP grow and economies flourish, but all of society changes.